SoapCentral.com presents the 46th Daytime Emmy Awards Red Carpet. From Pasadena, California, it's Soap Central's Dan Kroll. So you get a whole different set of questions on uh, the main Emmy night. Yes, okay. <laughs> In 30 seconds or less, mm -hmm. I want to know everything that's happened to your character over the last year and go. Oh my god, 30 seconds or less. Uh, she lost her baby. She fell in love with a, a new man named Eli. Um, she's currently falling in love with a little baby named David. Uh, she just said that she's going to have a leave of absence from work. And uh, yeah, is that 30 seconds? Is that good? That's enough information, right? I mean, that's like a whole lot of stuff. There's, yeah. that, that's like she lost a baby. She lost an engagement. She got a new man. New little baby. Yeah. <laughs> So I always want to know what the experience is walking the red carpet. I mean, is it, you walked on Friday, mm -hmm. you're walking in today. I yes. mean, does it, does the, the feeling change any? Is there um, a different energy? Do you still enjoy it? I do enjoy it. The energy is, de is definitely different this evening. I think, you know, there's lots more people here, uh, a lot of more different casts and artists and it's great and this thing is fun to play around with on the carpet I mean, so you, you were a little while ago there was I a had wind, the wind. I walked yeah, out I and like the wind just like <laughs> blew the cape so you know this that was good for my stylist <laughs> so that does bring sort of a good question which do you have more fun with do you have more fun with the posing for the pictures considering uh -huh. that's definitely something also from your past or do you enjoy the interviews more uh, I think the interviews that's such a great my answer. personality can come out more I think you know posing you have to kind of have this channel this inner thing inside of you and just you know have your Sasha Fierce come out okay. you know but interviews and a can, wind machine is definitely wind machine I'm saying. To, oops, sorry. <laughs> to blow my cape um, just took out another nominee but all, or something. It's okay. <laughs> all of it is really fun the dressing up part is really fun it's all great so yeah. one of the things that I like to do uh, only for the main ceremony because it gives me an opportunity to get in some trouble is I ask people to become part of the process. I want you to give me a question to ask to someone else. So the person before you is just down a little bit. Victoria had a question. Okay. She wants to know, mm -hmm. what is the last thing you ate? Um, vegan queso and chips. On my way here. <laughs> I mean, do you need to put in a plug? Like, is it some place that'll give you some free food? You can feel free to put in a plug. You don't have it to. It was from Whole Foods. <laughs> Whole Foods. I shop there quite often. <laughs> At Whole Foods. Yes. So now you get to return the favor. So now, you get to give me a question for whomever I so speak to next. next and I think it, I'm more than likely it's going to be her. So. Olivia, what is your guilty pleasure? I like that. That might get me in trouble. That could be fun. <laughs> Thank you for coming over Thank for chatting. You. I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank Got you for it. chatting with me. Absolutely. SoapCentral.com presents the 46th Daytime Emmy Awards Red Carpet. From Pasadena, California, it's Soap Central's Dan Kroll.